In this video, I'm going to go ahead and show you how you can connect a domain to MailChimp. For more tutorials, make sure you subscribe and let's get right into it. So this is a super simple thing to do, guys. The first thing you want to go ahead and do is come over to MailChimp and then you'll be on your dashboard. And then what you want to do from here is come down to your profile picture in the bottom left corner. Go ahead, click that and then go to account. And then once you've clicked on account, what you need to do is come to settings on the top bar here. Click on settings and then come down to domains. So once you've selected domains, what you need to do from here is scroll down a little bit until you see connect your domain. Go ahead and click on connect domain. And then you'll be brought to this here. So once you've got your domain ready, all you need to do is enter it in here. So for example, if I go ahead and put in my domain, what I need to do now is simply click on submit. And then as you can see, you get all this information here. So if you go ahead, copy this information and then go over to the website where your domain is hosted so whether that's namecheap godaddy uh, google domains or anything like that make sure you go ahead go over there and input this into your dns settings and stuff like that so what you need to do now is copy this here and then go to your domain host go ahead select your domain and then i'm on google domains here so i'm going to scroll down to the bottom and then what i need to do is find custom resource records and then if i want to go ahead and add this to mailchimp what i need to do in at i need to put in www and then go to c name and then leave that one as one hour domain name what you need to do is obviously copy this here and then go ahead and paste it in and then click on add and then it will take a couple of seconds and it will go ahead and add it to there and then go back to MailChimp, click the copy button on your IP address. And then what you need to do now is and then simply go ahead to this one here. Go ahead, click on edit and then change it to the one that you've just copied from MailChimp. Go ahead, click on save. And then as you can see at the top of the page, it will take effect within 48 hours. So it's just that simple, guys. If this video did help you out, please leave a like, comment, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you in the next one.